All right, at this point we are hitting the road. We are pretty much done in Novak at this point. And so, I was going a little off-road there, but we're going to get back to the road. And, interesting, a caravan. Hey there, need anything? Huh, I'd like to see you Sure, wares. here's what I've got. That's nice, she's got over 2,000, almost 2,500 cats. So, you know, that helps. This would be a good place to sell things if I hadn't just, like, done my repairs and stuff, so. Very cool, though. Good to know. What is over here? I see structures, and I'm like, uh, I want to check it out. What's over there? Huh. Sierra Madre. Well, we could go look. I don't know if we're at the right level for this or not, but we can look and kind of start there. Uh-oh. Oh, crap. Oh, there they are. Jeez. Sometimes EDE is, <laughs> EDE and, and my sniper buddy are so, so like, startling. They see things way before I will. It's just like, holy crap. I hate it when my vats messes up like that. better. What's that? Dang. Did I get them all? Dang it. I hate bugs. Lord help. Alright, let's heal up a bit. Because I didn't even see that coming hardly. Holy smoke. I think I'm poisoned. Yeah, I'm poisoned. I can hear the poison. Noise. What? What the heck? There's nothing in here. What are you acting like that for? Dude, you got PTSD or something. You're always freaking me out. I never know if there's actually something there or not. And I'm poisoned. Look at your face. Jesus, must be something outside that he's reacting to. Wow. Like, chill out, dude. Alright. Remove the poison. Seal up. Dang, that poison hurts. Alright. Good gracious. I really hate that the magazines are like a temporary adjustment that wears off. I don't like that at all. Why why can't they like be permanent? Like books are in one and two. Don't understand. Weapon repair kit. Hey, I like those. This is a little shack. I don't know where the owner is, but it's most likely that the owner is, you know, dead, because there are giant stingy poison bugs outside. So, you know, kind of how it is. The benches in here is a nice addition. Let's do a little save. Say, say, say. Oh, yeah. He's got his gun out. Uh, 
I like that EDE plays this little like. Oh my. Yep. Can't. That's the last. If the EDE ever. sees it first, then he plays this uh, this Western music. It's like. Darn. All right. Okay. Boom. Fine by me. I want to give you some stuff that you can use to heal and some ammo. I don't have much ammo. Ugh. Okay. E can just break down rounds. That's not what I wanted. There we go. That'll help. Need more microfusion. Microfusion, same. Uh, recycling microfusion is always the smartest. Fine by me. Yeah, you're out of ammo. All right, Boone. Give you some of these. There. Because you're a good shot, as long as I keep you in ammo. You're very useful. Alright, let's go. What the heck is going on here? Uh, We're getting close to Nelson. Any closer, I'm shooting any legionary I see. Hope that's not a problem. That's not a problem, Boone. That's a solution. Damn right. You and I, we're just a couple of problem solvers. Yeah. I hate them too, Boone. I feel ya. Oh, there's a bunker. An abandoned bunker. Well, let's go out there. Let's check it out. We're on, we're on an adventure today. We're being adventurous. Trying to see if we're the right level for this quest. Oh, crap. Oh! Especially when your vats is messing up. Come on. Alright. I don't want to shoot my buddy. Yeah, that thing. The thing with the teeth. Yeah. That'll work. Fire geckos. Frickin' fire geckos. Jeez. Dangerous out here. Yeah, that hurt. Alright. Well, I'm out of stim packs, so I'm gonna have to make do with food and stuff. Ba -ba -ba. I have lots of food. I'll be fine. Just gotta like try and keep out of trouble till I heal a bit. Yep, yep, yep. 
Nuka Cola. It's cold. It's refreshing. It's Nuka Cola. Now with extra sweet cherry flavor. No, it's just Nuka Cola. It's not cherry Nuka Cola. Yeah. Alright, let's look for this place some more. My hit points are coming up. Slow but sp slow but sure. Uh, Alright, what's next? Always a danger over the new horizon, I'm telling you. Let's go. Look at all the cool trees. These are very real trees, you know. They used real looking trees in here. That's kind of cool. Regionally specific trees. Um, we're looking for this abandoned bunker. Abandoned SOS bunker? I guess that makes it an emergency bunker, SOS. Huh. That's our sad music because we're wandering into danger. We are the lone wanderer who's not alone anymore. For the first time in Fallout, I am not entirely alone. I actually do have a group. A small group, but a group nonetheless. That's pretty cool. I have people. People that like me. Ah! Shoot. I hate that sound. <sighs> that means I did not see a mine. Well, it didn't hurt me too bad. I got pretty far away from it before it blew, so that's good. It's good news. Bad news is we now have to watch the ground for traps. Because we could come across one at any point around here. So, gotta keep our eyes peeled and try and see them. My perception isn't that great, so... Okay, there is the signs of a bunker for sure, which means there has to be a door somewhere around here. Yeah. Oh, it is the door. It said Brotherhood, but Brotherhood is still BOS. But I just see dead people going on here? Uh, what the heck? Save before we go in because I don't know if we're the right level. Wonder if it'll tell us. Dead money. Dead money takes you to an extremely dangerous area of the Mojave Wasteland, a one-way journey, until your business at the Sierra Madre is finished. In normal mode, you'll encounter new traps, enemies, and new companions whose lives are tied to yours. In hardcore mode, you'll be fighting the environment as well, a toxic city that erodes health over time. Companions are more vulnerable, and so are you. Dead Money is recommended for experienced couriers, level 20 plus. If you're up to the challenge, continue on. The Sierra Madre Grand Opening awaits and has been for 200 years. 
yeah, we are uh, not the right level for this at all. We are nowhere close to level 20. No. All right. No, no, no. Let's stay in the Mojave Wasteland because uh, we ain't the right level for that. And if we can't come back, then we're doomed. So we're just going to wait and we'll come back here when we're the right kind of level. Alright, so we can't do that quest yet. But now we can fast travel to it when we're the right level. So what else? Happy Trails Expedition. EDE, my love. I'm not going to bring him to the Gibson Scrapyard. Like, I can go look there, but that's where I do my repairs and stuff. But I'm not giving EDE up. Hmm. So, you're back. Now, where did we leave off? Uh, I don't see any Take new... Take care now. There's no new conversation things. So, I don't know why we're supposed to bring him here. Guess just if we wanted to scrap him, which we don't. We haven't done Helios 1 yet. We should probably head up to Helios. What do you think? Let's do a save here. Not sure what to expect. And head up to Helios 1. Come on, guys. It ain't that far. And then we can see what's up there. What's going on? I remember her saying NCR took it over from the Brotherhood. Oh, crap. Where are they? Where are they and why are they shooting? I don't see anybody. But who are you shooting at? Oh, crap. I see the caravan. I wonder if they need help. Are they okay? Are they alright? I don't see anyone trying to sneak up on them. Uh, might be that somebody went after them and got hurt because they seemed fine. They were walking away. So, I think that they, uh, they took out whoever was trying to rob them. Or whatever attacked them. Those caravanners are pretty tough. Helios 1. Helios. You have discovered Hugo's one. So what's happening here? Should be under NCR control. They chased out. Uh -uh. They chased out the. Uh, this is a restricted area. State your business. The Brotherhood. I saw this place in the distance and I wanted to investigate. Or you're a Legion spy trying to infiltrate our perimeter. Give me one good reason I should let you through. Uh, cause, dude, do I look like I'm from the Legion? Do I look like I'm dressed like a Roman? Do I look like I have problems even like putting together a freaking sentence without Caesar telling me what to do? Do, do I look like that? No. Okay, you're supposed to be smart. You're an NCR soldier. What are you doing? What you doing, huh? You're looking at me. Oh, how do I know you're not Legion? Because they all dress the same. Dear Jesus. I notice your solar tower isn't collecting much sunlight. I can help. No need. We already have an expert hard at work on it. Then again, our expert is an idiot. Hell, he might as well be a saboteur. 
I guess you couldn't do any worse. Have him fill you in on the details. He's in the back of the building. You'll know him when you see him. Keeps his sunglasses on all the time, even when he's sleeping. Interesting. Shouldn't there be more people than this defending a power plant? There should, but we're not getting much power out of it, so none of our enemies have big interest in it either. Not like Hoover Dam, anyway. We had a real fighting force here just long enough to take it from the Brotherhood of Steel. Then they got sent east to the dam like everybody else. Caesar's Legion sends skirmishers every so often, prodding for weaknesses mostly. The reality is, if they really wanted it, we'd all be dead. Interesting. Why was the Brotherhood of Steel here? Damned if I know. Put up a hell of a fight, though. We had them outnumbered, I don't know, 20 to 1, maybe? They held out as long as they could, lost most of their force before they retreated. Gave us a little parting gift, too. They had some of the plant running, but they shut it all down. Enabled an old security system, too, to keep us away from the controls. <sighs> Jerk-offs. Huh. Bye. Later. Okay, let's go on in, then. Let's see what's up. Uh, dude, aren't you supposed to be manning the desk? Who knows which side the... We're supposed to be relieved any day. That's what they keep telling us. I don't think anyone's coming. Probably not, man. I don't know what to tell you, like I've been out there. Huh, probably not. It's a dang mess out there. Got business here? You got a dog. The dog looks like it, it's hurt. You should probably take care of it better. Just saying. What's up here? Huh. It's a mess up here. You'd think they'd take better care of things. What the heck? You got crap all over the floor. You got you got a lamp on the floor. Pick it up, buddy. You're gonna light crap on fire. Try cleaning up the place. Good God. Like, what's wrong with you people? Need to get a commanding officer in here to boss you around, tell you what to do. What's in here? Hmm. Not much. Again, with when the light on the ground. When I got this assignment, the I ground. was hoping there'd be more gambling. You were hoping there'd be gambling in Helios 1. You've got issues. World's falling apart, and you, an NCR trooper, is thinking about gambling. What's in here? Looks like somebody was set up in here to fight off intruders. Again with the lights on the ground. What? Oh, that's to the wasteland and it's red. Maybe I shouldn't pick it. Maybe I should. Maybe I shouldn't. I don't know. It being red, like, I'll probably lose karma if I do. Yeah, I'm not gonna do it. Alright. That's another door. Ah. We're supposed to be relieved any day. That's what they keep telling us. I don't think anyone's coming. Yeah, no. They're not. No offense. Don't mean to upset you, but it is what it is, man. Like... The danger out there is real. It's in here. Ugh. Got stuck behind the door. Huh. <laughs> EDE, I want the door, not you. 
we're back at the front desk. That means we missed something. All right, let's look at the computer. On Tuesday, February 6th at 2 p.m., technicians will be running a test of Archimedes and its connectivity with our plant security system. Under no circumstances should any employee be outdoors on the plant grounds until the alarm klaxon has ceased and an all clear is given. We have death and dismemberment waivers from all employees on file and are not responsible for any accidents that should occur during this procedure. Protective eyewear is mandatory for all technicians observing from the tower deck. And this says, welcome to Poseidonet. Poseidon? Do you remember that? The ship Valdez? Interesting. All right. Results. The initial testing of Archimedes was a success, though not an unqualified one. Several minor systems were overloaded despite all precautions taken, and the two and a half minutes of downtime followed the testing is something we can work on improving. More importantly, we received reports from nearby facilities that they experienced system frying power fluctuations at the time of the test. Notably, the Black Mountain Communications Array and the military bunkers at Hidden Valley. We're going to make it a priority next time to prevent such collateral damage. Upcoming visit. It went too fast for me. Ooh, 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 wait. Let's see if I can get to it again. Hey, no. Here we go. It went so fast. Brigadier General Scott Lowe of the U.S. Army will be visiting the facility starting next Monday and staying on site indefinitely. When Archimedes goes live, he will be the only person here allowed to authorize its use for anything other than a test. Civilian employees are not required to salute, but it is expected of everyone that you observe thorough grooming and hygiene reg regimens and dress neatly while the General is with us. The general expects the best from all his men, and Poseidon men should be no different in the presence of such a fine and decorated soldier. Hmm. Can I tell him? A Poseidon Energy Publication for New Employees As a member of the Poseidon family, it will be natural for you to become enthusiastic about the incredible endeavors you'll be undertaking with us and to want to tell others. But just a second there, my good man. Let's take a minute to consider what could happen if company information fell into the wrong hands, and whose hands those might be. Can I tell my wife? Well, let's say you do. You tell her not to tell anyone. Your bond is sacred, but a woman's idle tongue is the devil's plaything. No sooner do you leave for work the next day than she's on the phone telling her best friend Candy. Then Candy tells Gertie. Gertie tells Maxine. Maxine tells Lulu. And while Lulu is telling Doris, a Chinese agent posing as an American operator listens in. And the next thing, she's on the line with the Forbidden City, singing like a treasonous canary. The following day, you and your wife are bound in shackles. And China is sitting at the controls of our entire arsenal. Can I tell my children? What father wouldn't want his kids to look up to him? Don't be that father. One day at school, Ivan Bulikov will get more than lunch money out of your kids. He'll have national secrets, and while they're parading him through the Red Square as a national hero, your children will be working in forced labor camps right next to you and your beautiful young wife, who's now wrinkled and homely since the communists have banned makeup because it expresses individuality. All right, you 
whoever wrote this, complete misogynist, like, to a disgusting level, and complete racist, like, wow. <laughs> Can I tell my drinking buddies? Surely, if there's somewhere safe, a man can place his trust. It's with his other male friends, but how much do you really know about them? Are they friends or comrades? Don't be too sure. Even the most transparent window can hide secrets when it's lined with iron curtains. Always remember, you are a member of two families now, and you have obligations to both. But your obligation to the Poseidon family is greater because while your children may misbehave and your friends may change and your wife may nag and cheat on you, because all women are evil, right? Poseidon energy will always be paying for and protecting your way of life, unless, of course, they're throwing your life away for a, you know, experiment or test. Don't tell anybody about anything when the projects of Poseidon energy. When pressed, tell them that your job is repetitive and not worth discussing. But the company is nurturing and gives good benefits. And is always looking for new talent. And is completely full of shit. All right. We missed somewhere that we need to go to find this guy. Definitely missed somewhere. Let's see. Go up here. And there's a door right here we went through. Nothing there but the room. This just comes down into another room. There's a door open there we went through already, and a door closed over there, okay. So that tells us where we're going. Or should be, anyway. All right. Ah. Another hallway. Oh, well, it's neater down here, at least, so far. Another door. Ah! Who the hell are you? They bring you in to replace me? They're replacing me, aren't they? Settle down. I'm not here to replace anyone. Damn right you're not. God damn right. Why would they? You can't top this guy. Just a little more time. You can't keep Fantastic down for long. Uh, what job do you have here? What else? I'm in charge. This whole operation depends on me. No fantastic, no power. Got the whole NCR suckling my teats, and it feels so good. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> you are too much. Really are. All right. Well what are you trying to accomplish here, buddy? Well, see, we're getting power because the guy running this place is fantastic. But the mirrors outside aren't aimed right, so we're running at 1% efficiency. And I guess that just isn't good enough for some assholes. Trouble is, most of the controls for this place aren't here. They're in the tower. And that place has some crazy pre-war security system that the dumb shit NCR set off when they took over. Killed two guys. Now they won't go near it. They want me to make an omelet, but I can't break any of their eggs. Know what I'm saying? Oh my god, this guy. How would someone retarget the mirrors? There's these two terminals outside. They control the mirrors. I tried fooling with them, but didn't get very far. You'd have to get them to talk to the mainframe up in the tower, then do the rest from up there. I'm guessing, but it sounds good, right? Hey. You're not thinking about going up there, are you? I am now. 
Well, hey, if you find yourself up at the mainframe, do yourself a favor and make sure you send the power to the right place. It needs to go to the Strip and McCarran. Why should the power go to the Strip and McCarran? Because I get paid, that's why. Per kilowatt hour. Whatever the hell that is. That's where the NCR wants the power, so that's where I want it. But you know, you do that, maybe I put in a good word for you with them. Fantastic's little helper. There's a reputation you can hang your hat on. <laughs> Why are you worried about being replaced other than the fact that you are completely useless, obviously? 1% power and you're complaining that they're complaining. Dude, really? Worried? Do I look worried to you? I've got this under control, baby. No one else can do what I do here. Yeah, except the trained monkey. Fuck, man. Everything. I push buttons, I turn dials, I read numbers. Sometimes I make up little stories in my head about what the numbers mean. Like one time I imagined they were a code to get into a vault full of naked women. Man, how cool would that be? Why is there no slap him in the head and knock some sense into him option? All right. How'd you get this job? It was easy, man. They were going door to door asking if anyone knew any scientists. I said, look no further. They asked me if I knew anything about power plants. I said as much as anyone I had ever met. They asked me how well I understood theoretical physics. I said I had a theoretical degree in physics. They said, welcome aboard. Wow. Here, you want this. It's the password to one of the terminals outside. Found it written on one of the stalls in the bathroom. Fantastic, my arse. Good God. All right, well. Before I go doing anything he says, might want to see if I can talk to anyone else in here that might give me more information about where the power is supposed to go or how to get there or because I don't like this guy I don't trust a dang thing he says um, not really finding anyone else Maybe I miss somebody that has a certain dialogue. Or I'll just have to go off what dude says, in which case that's scary. Wonder if one of these will have a new option now. Mm, let's take a look around. Water tower over there, power lines. What's on this side? Huh. All right, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a little recon on this place. And when we come back, we will start on this quest. How about that? All right. Catch you later, man.